Three receivers split to the near side. Brown looking, tucks it in, and he's taken down. First sack of the year for the Red Dragons defense. And it'll bring up fourth down. Maxwell unable to get into the backfield there. Wittenberg un unsuccessful. Side of boys, two receivers left. Play action. Boys looking to air it out. He's got a man downfield. It is caught. Touchdown, Red Dragons on the second play from scrimmage. Who other than J.J. Lapp? I think we could have guessed that that ball was going to Lapp. Boys saw it the whole time. Lapp had the safety. I'd love to see that, Bobby. Hand off to Gross. <laughs> oh, check it. Is the backup tailback. He's to the, oh, no, play action. I fell for it. Pass down the middle is caught for the touchdown. Holy cow, I fell for the bait that time with the backup tailback. And this game is a one-point ball game. To the far side of the field, a high, deep one, taking it about the 5, rolling up to about the 25 to the 30, and still on his feet for the Cortland Red Dragons is Rashad Tucker. So a great run back of about 35 yards, and Cortland will get a decent field position start to this next drive. Yeah, Rashad Tucker, you know, after... Three receivers stacked to the right side. Boys with a quick drop, throwing near side for lap. It is caught at the 12, and he's run out of bounds at the 3. Well, how about that arm? Zach Boys, just the precision, the accuracy. He saw lap all along. So now two receivers to the left side this time, and again they hand to Alfano St. John. Looking, he breaks the plane. Touchdown, Red Dragon. 38. Gain of 14 on that pass play. And now Brown steps up. Open man in the middle of the field. It is caught inside Cortland territory and down at the about the 35 yard line of the Red Dragons is Jake Souse. And a trip to see their old friend Lazarus Morgan. On fourth down, here's Brown throwing it up the right side. Man there, and it's broken up. Incomplete. Here is Boys in the pocket. Across the middle of the field, that ball is up and intercepted by the Tigers. I believe. Shotgun here for Brown, fakes the handoff to Gross, still looking, Ladero nearly there. And that ball is intercepted by Josh Cordero at the three. Well, you did you hear yourself call that? Review those words. Cordero was looking. He cut in front of the receiver on the far side of the field. He read it perfectly. He too, and he saw it boys he is going long to cole burgess bull just trying to look over his shoulder and that is complete to the 46. oh what a what a drag he dragged his his toes on the sideline just held him in bounds and great hands great perception by burgess to know where he was on the field and boys kaboom boys fakes the handoff and he is going long again to burgess and Burgess with another catch from the 11. Do we see a new connection? Last year it was it was Sagala, uh, Sagala and Cruz. Cruz. Now is it Boyce and Burgess? And Alfano St. John. Alfano St. John gets the handoff right up the middle, finds the gap. You just don't give him that much time. Boyce decides to keep that snap to himself and running up the middle. He's got a gap. Brought down at the 38. <laughs> They got a lot of weapons already in that Boys offense. Boys in the pocket. He's getting pressure across the middle of the field to J.J. Lapp. Back to the right side. Boys looking, going deep. That ball is caught for the touchdown. Rashad Tucker into the end zone for the Red Dragons. Boys, two-step drop, throwing over the middle. Lapp is cutting, and it's caught at the 40 to the 50, and he's gone. 30. 20, 10, house, touchdown Red Dragons. J.J. Lapp just had Jordan Stipe absolutely in his dust there. You could see it by the time he was at the 30-yard line. I said the twos moved up to be ones. You don't often see that. As here's a run to the far side of the field and down near the goal line and in for the touchdown touchdown is Jake Seuss. Jake Seuss. Wow. Will Ruckert nearly. Here's play action. Throw over the middle is complete. Out to the 40, out to midfield, and wrapped up his lap at about the 42-yard line. 
Lined up as a blocker left side. That's where Alfano St. John is. Machina in motion. They hand off. Alfano St. John straight up the gut. Touchdown, Touchdown Red Dragon. Single receivers to the outside. Boys looking downfield. Here's Lap. If he makes it, it's a record. He catches it at the 35. And he's dragged down at the 30-yard line. And there goes another record. How many ta- times have Portland run that play? And it's been successful every single time. Here is Brown. He's got pressure. He gets out of it. Looking, looking. Pass complete across the middle of the field. Drew Starrett on the rest. Brown, he gets that ball out to Gross. Able to miss a few, make a few guys miss, and he is into the end zone for a touchdown for the Tigers. Boyce in the pocket looking and nearly brought down. He's able to get it out. That pass completed. Alfano St. John. Alfano St. John cuts it back inside at the 20, the 10, and he is into the end zone. Brown in the pocket looking, and that is a touchdown for the Tigers.